All right. Hello, everyone. It is your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Welcome back. Okay, we are, of course, continuing right where our last live stream left off, and that is with Spider-Man Remastered on PC. This is, of course, modded. I keep wanting... I'm using a Xbox controller, and I keep wanting to press the B button as confirmation because I've been playing so much Tears of the Kingdom, and that will just back out and take me out of stuff. So, let's see. I've added... I, we only really just got started. I've only added a couple of mods since, and we have, there's still a few mods that I, we haven't even gotten to check out yet. I love this Spectacular Spider-Man suit. But, but, I want to, I want to go real quick. Let's see, we have this Venom suit that looks great, but I am really partial to, I love this Ultimate suit. I don't know what it is. I mean, I, a part of it is just nostalgia and what I grew up with, but I spent, I mean, the comics that I read in my youth were all, um, uh, all the Spider-Man comics were like drawn by Mark Bagley, pretty yours. much. I mean, I feel like I have so many Mark Bagley Spider-Man comics just outside of uh, Ultimate Spider-Man. But then you get into Ultimate Spider-Man, and that was a, that was very important in my youth. I love that comic and have pretty much every in terms of the first 100 issues every issue because I was purchasing them when they were new and so I love the Mark Bagley costume and it's great to see it in this game even if it is just modded but just ah it's the eyes especially Spider-Man I don't know he just he works with he really does work with the the big lenses all right I'm still getting used to the controls. I come from playing like Tears of the Kingdom, and I want to play this like uh, much completely differently. I should look for more towers to activate. I know this. Uh, yeah, we'll go on. And we'll hit that tower first. Wrong one. Nailed it. Really, no reaction? Not going to say anything at all. All right. Well, I'll just stand here and fart and run away. Yuri, I'm at a fist construction site, and there's a lot of guys here who aren't exactly constructing. What are they doing? I want to go find out. Huh. Just got a text from Doc. Looks like he attached an idea for a Spidey gadget. Man, does he ever stop inventing? You can now craft the impact web. Cool, all right. Wow, this looks like it could work. Oh, nice. All right, that's pretty nifty. Do 
10 finishers. Okay, that was pretty cool. Just wait for you to stop looking over here. Three of five. Almost got them all. Got Kevin. Oh, wow. I didn't Man, know they said Anywhere shit. Here. Well, there you go. You learned something. Spider-Man got Kevin. Did the guy really just say I wouldn't want to fight me neither? Really? Ah. Uh, I'm telling you, the sky... Th this game really is beautiful. Now, I'm, I am running a, a complete overhaul lighting mod, but just... The improvement that that mod did for the lighting, for, for me, is just incredible. All right. One, two, and two more inside, and then the two out there. Okay.
Uh oh. So they found me. Hey, Ed, how are you doing? Okay. Let's see. Are they all going to stand there and wait for me? Let's lure you over to walls. Uh -oh. Yeah, I'm not. That's I'm. I'm really not much of a of a stealth person. I, I'm not very sneaky. He's okay. Hopefully he lands on his head. It's really soft. Okay. Where is... Ed says kicking people off roofs is the spider way. Yeah, it looks like that. Okay, your new suit comes with a power. Dang, looks like they called their buddies. Where are they? Oh, hey, more guys. Welcome to the party. House rules. Leave your shoes at the door. Unless you're not wearing socks, in which case, find some socks already. Just waiting for these guys to show up. Eventually, they're gonna they're gonna make it up here.
dude is a rocket launcher. Oh, he just... Oh. Ed says that Kingpin really invested in rocket launcher based construction Place methods. Yeah, down, I mean Captain. these guys are just walking around. It's like holy crap. Them. It's like they're Someone dentists from It's Always Sunny. Shots fired, so I've got officers inbound. Good work. Fit kept more construction sites throughout the city, vetting their fronts too. Keep an eye out and report in if you see anything suspicious. Ed says, I'm more of a Charlie guy myself. <laughs> I mean, again, I, I pretty much love every character in that show, but Dennis is fascinating. When I, The episode I really fell in love with Dennis is the, um, I don't remember all the episode names and stuff, but uh, they it's when they, the gang sees the psychiatrist and he draws, he draws her. <laughs> and I, was, I love it. And then I, I also love the, the Dennis method. Sites. I should recalibrate my mapping software to be more accurate. Using a depth map post process on photos of popular landmarks should do it. And I know just the one to start with. Okay. Don't think I can get anything right now. Yeah. Ed says I can definitely see the dentist there. <laughs> Dodge window throw. Yeah, how the combo counts. Yeah, sure, why not? And then missions. Okay. Now we're just running right along. Fantastic, Doc. We're back on track. Provisionally, as long as our little incident has gained the mayor's attention. You'll be at the fitting tomorrow? Definitely. Oh. Good old Empire State. Man, I love this town. Time to grab a snapshot. Hold it. Subject off center. Done much photography since quitting the bugle. God, how much I enjoy it. Should keep an eye out for more landmarks to shoot. Holy crap! I have, I have completely forgotten how much just little, all the little things there is to do. Why is there a panda? Mr. Lee. Hello. 
Peter, it's Martin Lee. I just wanted to let you know we need a little extra time to get set for May's party. I guess the cake delivery is stuck in traffic. Oh, sure thing. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll swing by. Great. Talk to you soon. Oh, I <laughs> didn't know the camera disabled. Okay, got some time to kill. Let's see what's happening out in the city. Doc, sorry about that. You were saying you've smoothed things over with the grant committee? Provisionally, as long as our little incident escaped the mayor's attention. You'll be at the fitting tomorrow? Definitely. It'll go great. We're gonna change the world, Doc. I'll settle for not starting any more fires. See you tomorrow, Peter. Here's to a successful day. Yay. Officers be advised. A mugging was just Hi, Mr. Lee. Hey, Peter. We're all set for the party whenever you're ready. Cool. I'm on my way. I'll tune my earpiece to listen for sounds of someone struggling. I'll set my earpiece to focus on muffled voices. My earpiece picks up cries for help close by. Let the jaws of life or something, please! Come on out, stretch your legs. I really wanted to get one. I sent you. Those are the guys! Get them! This is between me and him. That is a... <laughs> okay, one more and I got this challenge. I think I just interrupted him because he stopped talking in the middle of his sentence. Entering feast. So I was doing mod searches, and Mr. Lee's probably in the kitchen. Come to find the out, there are a lot of nudie mods for Spider-Man Remastered. I am 
Hey, casual gamer, how you doing? So yeah, I was looking up, because again, I've been wanting, you know, I'm going to mod the hell out of this as much as I can, and the amount of nudie mods is hilarious. You can literally get a mod with a full frontal, completely nude Peter Parker, and I'm just like, wow. Oh, okay, that was it. I thought that might be going and like there might be something. Hey, Martin, I'm so sorry I'm late. You're right on time. Just keep her distracted while we get everything ready. You got it. Mr. Negative. Hey, this is my favorite aunt. Peter, what a nice surprise. Need some help? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, there are some heavy no, boxes. No, no, no. I mean, I mean, I mean, not yet. I mean, I came to, uh... uh, uh just, just Ed wondering. says, yeah, I've seen this Peter in some precarious situations. Mary Jane, too. Oh, yeah, let's see. Peter Parker, um, Mary Jane, Peter. Silver Sable, and Black Cat all have nudie mods. And I find that hilarious. No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Girl problems again, huh? What? No, that's great. I still wish you were I bet now, because I haven't looked in depth, but I bet Aunt May. I bet there is a nude what? Aunt May model. Uh, so if you want, you can literally have this entire game and play it with all the main characters completely naked. Oh, and I also found a mod that turns Norman Osborn into Willem Dafoe. I was very tempted to use it until I found out that. The mod, so much there's no, um, uh, there's no face match. So the mod doesn't, the mouth is not articulate. Right. It's just a, it's just a static face. Even some of the two different Peters in one game. Oh yeah, that I always forget about that. I, 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 f I know obviously that they switched the face. I played this on PlayStation Four. I, I have the original version of this game, but I always forget that that's. A big deal. But speaking of that, yeah, there. I also saw a mod that replaces Peter with the PS4 Peter Thanks and replaces the oh, photos of this Peter well, with the PS4 Peter. Like real we commitment to it. That's that's crazy yeah, to me. I think that's a weird. Uh, that's a weird like hill to die on. Is uh, of is again for the party th and this it really means a lot. kind of craziness about the the Peter face? But you know whatever. Voicemail from Yuri. You should check it outside. Oh, he walks really slow. And then there's also some simple kind of silly mods where you can skip all the um, uh, crappy Miles missions or Mary Jane missions or both. And I only remember it vaguely. I remember them not being my favorite things, but it wasn't worth it for me to install a mod to skip those let's see ed says static faces like that grease prequel show where an actor dropped out and they put a static png over another actor's face i have no idea what we're talking about. i didn't it i want to see that i'm sure there's clips on you i'll have to remember I, i've never seen that voicemail from yuri Auction house holding fifth of the state sale just tripped. Could you check it out quietly? I don't want to make a scene if it's nothing. Fisk estate sale sounds fun. Wonder what the kingpin had hidden in his closet. I'll link it to you later. It's ridiculous. I look forward to it. Oh. Man, Fisk goes away and suddenly it's amateur hour. These guys are already breaking. I better stop the entrance. Peter, I lost track of you at the party. Yeah, I uh, had to get to the lab. Hey, where are Sorry. you going? Don't apologize. I just wanted to tell you how much what you said meant to me. I always wonder if I'm doing right by you. 
Well, stop wondering. Also, I liked the MJ and Miles sequences, but I enjoy so stealth games. Would have fallen apart if not for oh, the break-in failed. Well, well, oh well. Nay, I... I don't know what to say. Oh, I think Mr. Lee needs my help. I should go. See you soon, dear. Casual Gamer says, Do you think Venom will get his own standalone game in the future? Uh, I would be shocked if he didn't. Um... You know, he already has... Uh, really, it's not... He already has a very, you know, two successful films. We're getting a third Venom film. It's obvious that Sony wants to have a black symbiote Spider-Man movie. So, I mean, I, I feel like it's inevitable, you know? The, the question is, is who does it? And I personally, this is just me... But I feel like we're going to get Spider-Man 2. And then after Spider-Man 2, we'll get a spinoff using the symbiote assets and the, you know, the, the Spider-Man 2 New York. And it will, instead of, you know, like, like they do with Miles Morales, instead of Miles Morales, it will be Lethal Protector. That's what I think is the perfect situation that we could be in. Well, it just popped up. There it is. Okay. But I think, I, for me, like that to me is the first step to really getting a a quality Venom game. I get used to those quick time events again. Well, let's see. Ed said they've not yet announced a season pass or DLC for Spider Man 2, have they? No, they haven't. They also haven't announced a release date, so I, I feel like all that's going to be. I mean, I, I really do feel like all that's coming. I, I'll be shocked if Spider Man 2 doesn't have a season pass. It just it feels inevitable. And the original season pass was. Well, the season pass for the first Spider Man was really successful, so it's, it just seems like a no brainer. I think a lot is just staying hidden just because there's so much of the story we don't know. Hey, it's the negative guys. Is the file. There's someone else here. They must have taken it. Those masks. Who are these guys? I... There's looks like a high speed I... progress. Copy that. Well, so for one, in a way, we've had two Spider Verse games: Shattered Dimensions and Edge of, Edge of Tomorrow. So it's not out of their own possibility. And those games came before the um the spider-verse events in the comics you know the hell the animated series from the 90s did the spider-verse first it just wasn't called spider-verse so yeah i think something like that is possible i always i, I always think like you can't close the door on anything me personally i got to do this quietly hope don't want to alert the others it wouldn't i i hope it wouldn't take the place of 
Spider-Man games like this because I I'm not interested in the Spider Verse, you know, and so that that kind of is I well, I mean to say I think the Spider Verse is fine for an event. I you know I I get all of that, but that's not who like Spider-Man that. is for me. You know, for I I've always felt like Spider-Man with you know aliens and. Lava. Aliens and multiverse stories shouldn't be the regular Spider-Man story, and I, I hope that they know not to n not to get lost in the big event constantly. Get behind an enemy for a stealth takedown. Silently defeat enemies. This I'm not good at. You stay quiet. And let's see. I swear. Ed I says, do you expect that info to drop this summer or in one of the showcases this you? week in Where terms of uh, Spider-Man 2? I, 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 I want to say yes. Uh, I'm really excited for the Summer Game Fest tomorrow, and we're going to be live streaming the Summer Game Fest. So I'm really Yo, press R to show enemies that are safe for takedown. Oh, that was a nice little camera move. I, I like that. But, uh, let's see. Can I hop up anywhere? For every don't move. Mary Jane. Hey. MJ? What are you doing here? Same as you. Working. At least was I also like this oh, narrative I, uh, change for Mary Jane I think the whole actor thing it doesn't work so for me Robbie but I, I like this for the bugle? well Robbie doesn't technically know I'm here and it wasn't a break-in until a few minutes ago uh, uh huh let me explain oh okay 15 minutes earlier I think we're about to play one of those stealth missions But yeah, I'm really hoping the Summer Game Fest tomorrow has some updates on Spider-Man 2 and Transformers Excuse Reactivate. Me. Since Transformers Reactivate got re announced at Game I Awards, I'm hoping Jeff Keighley has Quite something so up his sleeve. Because last year's I Summer like Game Fest was was a bit disappointing. Well, I don't. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, Craig? No, sorry, it just, it looks like we're going to have to run something else on the cover. I don't know, uh, maybe the expressionist piece? You know what? I think I can make today work. Are you sure? You're here. No moment like the present. Thank you. Craig? Never mind. We're good. Let's get started. This is also a good, who, I, I feel bad. I, who played Mary Jane in this? Look around and familiarize yourself with be waiting by the Baku statue when you're ready to begin. Can do. Let's see. Ed says, I like the bugle change. What I don't like is that it seems like every MJ sequence is given as flashback. Oh, yeah. That is right. It kind of is. I mean, I don't remember ev <laughs> Holy shit. She's in Dragon Ball. And she's also, uh, well, critical role, Dragon Ball Z. I'm, I'm sure, you know. I could. Uh, Laura Bailey has a massive list. She's also Black Widow. But wow, I can hear it now. That's incredible. That's all really awesome. I remember when Chris Clark went in for the importing artifacts like this. He bought the local hardware to cover his tracks and laid off the old staff, including my dad. 
Whose father ran out of the other table but Charles? Oh, that's also an interesting change. I didn't pay attention to that in 2018, but Mary Jane mentioning her dad in a positive way does not have a good relationship with her biological parents in the comics, so that's a, that's a big change. Sometimes I feel like the whole history of the world is just boys playing dress-up, getting into fights. Hmm, and Claudia, weren't they just in league? It says Laura Bailey is so many great characters. Uh, she really is. I mean, of course, like for me, it, she immediately she's she, you know trunks. Oh, that's that's it just immediately what I go to. Kyoto, so beautiful. Uh, part of me wishes I could drop everything. Let me know when you're ready for the game. Sounds good. Starting with the prize, a one-of-a-kind Taka Mondaku. Oh, beautiful. It's from Masune? Correct. Mr. Fist has exceptional taste. Ed says Do maybe the good relationship well? with her dad is why she became a reporter. Yeah. I, that is. That's really, that's a very, really interesting distinction that I didn't pay attention to. I feel bad I missed that in 2018. It's such a little note, and obviously, if you don't if if you don't follow the comics, it, it doesn't matter. But it's an interesting change. Now, this exquisite piece exemplifies the traditional Kawashikami pedal beat effect. The king. I just got the lady's arm in there. I can see why such. If I was really doing this, I would have to retake that photo. Her arm just lopping in there doesn't make a good photo. Was there ever anything irregular in any of the? Where does she keep the camera? No, of, of course not. Not that I was aware of. There it is. Oh, okay, it just kind of like... Notice the intricate gold inlay on this ceremonial tea set. Is this... A friend in the DA's office mentioned that Fisk used the cover. We were, um, we've been re-watching all the Spider-Man films. We started with the Tobey films, we watched the two Venom films, and we watched the first Amazing Spider-Man film last night, and we're going to watch the second Amazing Spider-Man film. But, um... But it, it is, it, it, that's actually something we talked about after watching the film is like, the relationship with her dad in that is very close to the comics, and here it's interesting to see. Uh, it's, it's it, I, I wish I had remembered or, or paid attention sure to that line, but also it's been quite a few years since I've played this. Um, Ed said when he played this sequence, he made sure the lady was the sole focus of every shot. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait here, please. I think it's time for you to go. Oh, um, could I use the restroom real quick? Fine, follow me. Thank you. This, this is a really lovely space. It is, and this will be the last time you see it. The ladies is around the corner. Be quick, of course. Oh, Ready? wow. She's kind of a bitch. All right, this is going to be really nitpicky, and I'm sorry, but I wish I could choose to walk a little faster, <laughs> just a little bit. Um, Casual Gamer says, do you think a new Lego Marvel game and a new Marvel vs. Capcom game hap will happen in the future or could happen? Lego Marvel, no, just because of, I don't know if that, Hello, I, I, I hate, I don't want to be a doomsayer, because you know, I, I don't like that, but the puff piece we agreed upon. I don't think. No. She's here now. Lego, I, I don't know I've if that company has a has much of a future right in terms of development just, just because of how bad it has been for them, you know, so I've heard. And again, I don't want to be that kind of doomsayer. So I don't know what the future of Lego games period will be. But as for, ooh, 
Oh, little box. Um, Marvel vs. Capcom, though, yeah, I believe very strongly like that will. Oh, now I can move quickly. Misinvestigated journalists arrested. And the second thing I'm going to do is collect your head, Ray. Hey, she's pissed. It is most definitely a threat. Uh huh. Oh, crap. Sure, Craig. Right. I don't believe you. Is she going to turn the other side again? Uh huh. Sure, Craig. Pete told me about this. Chris used it to hide evidence. Why did the cops take it? I know the statue opens. The weapon, the hand. The Neo behind them. That looks different. Casual Gamer says, I love the Marvel vs. Capcom series, so if we get a new one, I'll be happy. Yeah, it, it, honestly, I just believe it's really just a matter of... Because the last Marvel vs. Capcom kind of hurt the brand a little bit, and I think it's just a matter of removing itself from that, but I'll be shocked if we don't get another. The statue can move. Most common pose is latent power. Mouth closed, left arm down, right palm facing forward. Hmm. Pieces move. Okay, yeah. I think it's supposed to be this one. Let's see. Casual Gamer says, could Insomniac introduce co-op to Spider-Man 3 or even make a standalone multiplayer expansion or game? I, a standalone multiplayer expansion or, or game, I, I think that would be more likely. Uh, That's not right. Well, it wasn't right. Well, never mind. I don't know, and 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 again, I'm I'm happy to be wrong. I don't know if the I don't know if the main like numbered titles will warrant like co-op in that way. Oh my bad. There's the one. Ed said they made it sound like they had no intention of on including multiplayer into these games so far. Yeah, exactly. Like the main games, I don't know. Like I I don't imagine it. I, I can't imagine like Spider Man three having co op. But I could imagine Insomniac making a co op Marvel for. game. Now the question is whether or not we want them to devote time breath. to that or if they're better served making narrative story driven <laughs> games. You know, I don't want to sacrifice a Venom game or a Wolverine game or a Wolverine sequel to Excuse a co-op Marvel me, game. You, you can't be... 
lady, they're wearing masks with guns. <laughs> trying to debate them is like trying to debate a Texas in, citizen. In, in there. I was on my way to the exit when I saw you. You're lucky to be alive. This is the guy I saved five minutes ago. Listen, whoever these met. Yeah, you too. Not exactly how I pictured us meeting again, though. Honey, that's exactly how I pictured it. Did she change her perfume? Focus, Pete, focus. <laughs> Clear these guys out before I push forward. Okay, so I still can't go full action. Um, Ed says, I've been watching Poker Face. A debate with a Texan is not one you survive. <laughs> I, I don't know that okay, reference. Pete, I'm heading near the front. Give the word and I'll make a break for it. Will do. How about that file? What's in it that these guys want so bad? You know, Doug, something called Devil's Breath. Fisk was hired to build a secret research lab for it. I'm not clear what Devil's Breath is, but it seemed to scare Fisk. He compares it to Pandora's box. Not much shook Fisk. We need to get you and that file out of here. Hang tight. There we go. I think that should be very obvious that I have not seen that now. Keep it tight, Pete. Uh oh. MJ. Ah, uh, they got her. Well, there you go. trying to think. Well, I mean, I, it doesn't really matter because this is a different cannon, but I was trying to remember in terms of... I mean, I fought Spectres, but, you know, technically Spectres aren't ghosts. All ghosts are Spectres, but not all Spectres are ghosts. You know what I mean? Uh, seems like this is an energy thing, not a ghost thing. Huh? Let's see. Casual Gamer says, is there a new Batman game currently in development? No, not that I know of. Uh, I have to be completely honest. I only know about, well, everybody knows about the Wonder Woman game. But, uh, I only know about the Wonder Woman game, Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League, and the Superman game. That's it, honestly. I haven't heard anything about Batman. The plan, well, at least as far as I understood it, but the plan was for Gotham Knights to spin off in its own franchise. But that's no longer happening. Uh, Gotham Knights was not the success that WB wanted. Um, I hope that doesn't hurt future franchise opportunities. That's a whole, um, could, honestly, like that's a whole conversation we could get into. But, um, but no, with Gotham Knights being the critical and commercial kind of middling failure that it was I think it's I th I, we're going to be waiting for Batman I think I know a proper Batman game for 
a little while yet unless there's some kind of surprise and trust me i would love a surprise but it looks like the next time we're seeing batman is suicide squad and suicide squad's probably going to be shit you don't even work for heritage arts never said i did hi mary jane watson daily bugle you you will not write a word of what you saw here. for the record what do you know about the file those masked men store that I don't. What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney. Hey, texting. Nick, this is the last six months never happened. Casual Gamer says, for the Superman game, do you think they will announce it sometime next year? Uh, yeah. I I, th I mean, so obviously this is just my opinion, and this is just me from a, a marketing perspective. But if, if I was if, if I was in charge of it, if, if I was consulting on it, I would not talk about Superman until we were away from Suicide Squad kill the Justice League yeah. well, and an we have something more definitive to say on Wonder today. Woman and we were closer yeah, to the release of the Superman movie. film because honestly Again. putting uh, Superman the game like out close to the release of the film yep. is just a smart logical head. decision in my opinion so it's another night in the city. but but there story there? I, I don't know like let's not make it talk about this <sighs> With the writer strike, we, depending on how much gets delayed, and then we have the actor strike that is probably going to end up happening. They reached a tentative guild. Uh, well, they reached a tentative agreement with the directors guild, so that strike probably won't happen. But we still have the writer strike and the looming um, actors guild strike. So if Superman gets delayed, I don't want that to also delay the Superman game. So it's it's that kind of tough balance, but. I do, I do strongly believe, like, don't, because everybody is expecting it to be something that it is absolutely not going to be, and it sucks, but you need to get away from that game before you talk about Superman and Wonder Woman. Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Cool. Love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorite. <laughs> Stanley. That is, I mean, like, uh, it's a fun statement and it's great getting Stanley in here, but that is really unfair because Stanley actually made it very clear he wanted Peter to end up with Gwen Stacy. He did not like that. The re how, how strong the response was to Mary Jane and that they were pushing Mary Jane because of her sudden popularity. I know I had a skill point. There it is. What's this one? Sure. Ah! Damn it. I'm still playing. I'm, I'm treating the buttons like freaking Tears of the Kingdom like a Nintendo. Uh, Ed says, I'm excited for Wonder Woman. The Nemesis system is like, I love the Mordor games and... You know what, sure. Those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. Oh, there he is. I was like, where'd that other guy go? Oh, just like a little I bitch realize slap. the irony in me saying this, but I hope you've learned not to hit people.
I, yeah, I got it. Yeah, it's, it's really easy to get lost in this combat. This is actually really solid. Just coming off of some really shitty action games, like this is really, <laughs> this is really solid. I was playing Gotham Knights and like, oh my god. It's crazy, like, just how the significant downgrade of, of Gotham Knights compared to Arkham or even this game. Like this saying like I I love the Mortar games. And I was yeah, I was just saying like I, I don't know I don't know what the consensus is, cause fuck reviews, you know what I mean? But I really do love the Mortar games and that Nemesis system was so incredible and so awesome i don't get why wb restricts it so much it's such a versatile i mean like not even just versatile just all the things you can imagine that they could possibly do with it i i, I don't get it Hey! Hi, Herman. My next mod. Shocker. And a more comic book appearance. That's what you said last time. I don't want to hurt you. You just slow me down. Wow, that's considerate. What's the money for, Herman? Actually, I don't. I'm just trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking. But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. Herman? What? Do you only answer to Shocker now? Mr. Shocker? Casual Gamer says, I love the Mortar games too. It is a shame we won't get a third one. Yeah, it really does suck because it was. Honestly, oh, Herman, man, they were so good. Again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. Ah. Long button press. Let's see, and Ed says, yeah, it sucks that the that they copyrighted because you can imagine what incredible things people could have made. I know. I mean, not even just with license, licensed games, but like, holy crap. And Ed says, I feel like the story reached a good end point with the second game. Would have been nice to explore different characters with some of the same systems in another region of Middle Earth. Yeah, now see, that I agree with. I mean, don't get me wrong. The characters that were part of the second game, absolutely. I, I, I agree. Like, we got, I think, a holiday 2024, absolutely. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah, I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask... It's almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. I feel bad. I cut the conversation short unintentionally. This 
Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Oh, I can move fast. Oh, awesome. All right. That's just me. That that was on that's on me. Don't think about it. Ed is taking the quote uh, that I ruined. If anyone has any info on that mask, it's almost morning. Classic phrase. <laughs> Peter, what can I do for you? Uh, sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. And she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Casual Gamer says, it seems that there's some cuts in the stream that skipped over your answer, so you were saying you right. think it will be open world, yeah, right? Sure. Oh, I, I mean, yeah, yeah you asked if it could be open world. Uh, absolutely. Ed yeah. says, I'm going to head off. Have a good rest of stream. Thanks, Ed. Thank you for Somewhere dropping in. Um, yeah, I think, I think Wolverine could be open world. Uh, I mean, again, we've seen Insomnia be really successful with it. Uh, my father. Uh, Read me ghost stories. It, I, I think large areas is also a possibility that he explores, like large zones that he explores. Listen, I, I think that's I'm also asking. very possible because the great thing about Wolverine is he's a character he that you don't have to limit be. just to New York. Like you can put Wolverine in a lot of different situations because of his connections across the Marvel universe. And I, I don't, I don't want them to waste that kind of opportunity to see just other you parts of the, the mutant world, basically. But some of that depends on where in Wolverine's life we're finding him. Is he an X-Man? You know, has he been an X-Man? Does he know the X-Men? Does he know Xavier? Does he know Magneto? There's so many questions that we just don't have answers to quite yet. Hey, the symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. It's never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Sad chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little Spidey work out in the city. All right. Let's see. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, I got I don't know which one I want. So I'm going to do a manual save because it is 350, so it's getting pretty close. I'm going to start getting dinner ready, so I'm going to wrap up here. I want to thank everybody who chose to drop in chat. Thank you all so much for watching and being a part of it. I'm really excited. Tomorrow is the Summer Game Fest event. We're going to live stream that entire event. Hopefully, hopefully, there's some really exciting news to talk about. At the very least, at the very, very least, 
come on, Jeff, give me some news on Transformers Reactivate. Give me a, a, a beta start date. Give me something tomorrow on Transformers. So, oh, casual, last question for the stream. Casual Gamer asked, do you think Wolverine will get a sequel? At, honestly, so sequels are always dependent on whether or not the game is successful. I can't see Wolverine not being a successful game. To me, that's just crazy. So, like, yeah, 100%. I think we're seeing the start of another big franchise. I think Wolverine's going to be an M-rated, high-quality franchise, and I I can't see it just getting one game. I think we're in for the long haul with Wolverine and Spider-Man, hopefully anyway. I can't see Spider-Man 2 being a, 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 a sales bomb. If it is, so be it, but I don't see that happening with this character. Anyway... Again, thank you all so much for watching. Above all else, and most importantly, stay safe, take care of others, and have a marvelous day.